tortoise controlling gameplay. Oh damn, must be the tortoise picking two different snacks with different labels of challenges or gameplay style. Um, no, this one is a wee bit different. This time I will use the tortoise head's facing direction as my guide on my keystroke. If the head's facing front or north with the body as the base, then I will hold the W key or W tab or whatever. If northeast, then I shall click WD and WA for northwest. Of course, there's no way for the tortoise to turn 180 degrees to the south, I mean the head, and therefore the S key shall not be affected by the tortoise and shall be freely utilized. Finally, please don't take this video too seriously, I swear to god. It was actually quite a challenge, mostly because I have strafing instincts during fights, so my gaming thing is sometimes to suddenly hit an A or D key, so if you ever spot me doing that, once or twice, allow it. Chill. I will label myself cheating whenever I see very blatant rule breaking, like I just hold the D or A key for a long time or just spam clicking it, you know, during the strafe, then I will label myself cheating. Don't worry. Anyways, enjoy the video. Oh, finally, uh, the tortoise is named, so I will tell you what I shall name her at the end of the video. I need to put a pencil case between my mouse using area and my tortoise, otherwise she will go there and bite the wires and that wouldn't be too well. <laughs> we did. <laughs> I don't know if that counts to be honest. I kind of went a bit WASD there. <laughs> should we rule out strafing by the way? Like, should strafing be not allowed? I guess. I suppose. Are we still going off? I'm not paying attention to my tortoise. I need to pay attention to my tortoise. Oh shit! Do not move! Can you chill? Excellent, 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 excellent. Suck my balls, young child! And no hacks, just Chinese, thanks to my tortoise. Can you chill? Holy shit! Because the head is going north. Well, so there is no. Holy coexist. Yeah! Allow it, man! I'm trying my best! <sighs> Do you not know Minecraft is Anyways, uh, how should I do this? Bridging doesn't count, like I said, yeah! Whoa, 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 whoa. Why are you like this? Are you. Mm. We're going north. I cheated. We're going northeast. We're going northeast again. We're going very northeast. We're going north. Northwest, actually. I did it! A 0.4 win lose ratio. Allow it, allow it, allow it. Fucking allow it. I haven't played this game for like, what, 70 years. Finally, we arrive at the moment to find out who are the clowns that has zero attention span and cannot read a natural fucking book anyways. Right, so that's the video for the tortoise name. Just comment down below, I will choose the one with the most likes. Also, the tortoise is a she. I also recently started a patron. Yes, 94 subs and I'm already starting a patron. However, if you're some sort of haven-like British type rich human being, you can join the partisan membership for some of my former Minecraft projects. Don't expect too much, please. 
like I swear these projects can either be quite top tier or they can be outright homeworks. Finally, let's clown on the ones who has zero attention span and has already left the video also to everyone who doesn't understand Chinese or Japanese. I use the Japanese language at the title to specifically clickbait people who clicks on any video with Japanese titles and a pet and expect 4K resolution of the cute pet. The Japanese and Chinese subtitles are also random to the point that the locals will get more confused than the ones who doesn't know the language. One subtitle was me saying Chiang Kai-shek is very bold, he looks like an egg with a mustache, very cute, something like that. So yes, get fucking clickbaited. But hey, at least you can clown on the ones who has zero attention span and couldn't make it to the end of the video knowing they are getting played. One last thing, I actually don't know Japanese. Subscribe.